Hi, hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. My name is Lulu and I'm an intuitive tarot reader and I'm here to give you some spiritual messages and some guidance, clarity. The topic here today is going to be about who is jealous of you? Who is jealous? Who's hating? Let's find out for you today. Now, if you've never done a pick a card, you can pause the video and take your time and choose your pile intuitively. Um, and I'm going to be leaving the time stamp down below in the description. So if you like to skip to your pile, you can go ahead and do that. Now, this is pile number one. It says eyes. Big, round, chino or Chinese looking. So if you are attracted or intuitively drawn to pile to eyes, your power will be number one. Power number two is shine, influencer, creator, star. So if you're intuitively drawn to power two, it says shine here. Power number three is gossip. It says conversations, report statements, involving details are about are not confirming as true so if you are drawn into the lead to gossip your pal is number three now let's go ahead and get started with pal number well, let's clear out the energy real quick let's start off with pal number one but i'm gonna go ahead and clear out the air the entities so my pal number ones if you pick eyes round chinese chino big whether whatever it is that you will mostly are attracted to let's go ahead and clear out the energies first spirit universe and sisters angels thank you so much for coming here today and guiding me to do this reading and protecting me and my viewers from any negative, any negative energies any negative entities any negative thoughts please guide me and help me give the most accurate most clearest messages for all my viewers today okay part one you pick eyes so who is jealous of my pound number one i'm getting somebody either you or this person that's jealous of you um could look could look chinese because that's something that stood out a lot for me like chinese eyes chinky eyes um they could be round but they're still chinky i'm getting your this person is jealous of you pal one could be somebody that looks at you or like is constantly drawn to you their eyes are constantly drawn to you whether you're around them or not like you could be across the street or like you know walking and this person this person you you constantly just find them you catch them like looking at you that's jealous of you but let's go ahead and get started baby pile number ones so spirit universe and sisters angels can we please have some clear honest truthful messages from my pound number ones here today on who is jealous of them spirit who is jealous of my pound number one please and thank you okay we got here the king of wands let me, go, let me go ahead and get a couple more for you power one and then i'll get started with your reading okay spirit thank you eight of swords Mm, okay, Paul. <laughs> okay, Paul. One, I'm getting an energy. Somebody that it, it could this could be your ex that's jealous of you, that's constantly watching you, they could be stalking you. You got here the chariot, 
And in the back of the deck, we got the Two of Pentacles. So, who is jealous of my pile number ones? I'm getting an energy that... It, this could be somebody from your past, like an ex-lover or ex-friend as well. Pile one. And I feel like this person was really passionate towards you. Um, they gave you a lot of affection and love attention as well um and i feel like they're really jealous because you made them feel like they were trapped trapped not saying that they were trapped with you but they were trapped with their emotions for you because either you left them because and move forward without them or like you just moved away from them moved out of their house this could be the, also the energy you were in. You could have been feeling trapped and emotional. Um, but I feel like you left this person. Whether they were your friend or a lover. I feel like um, you guys were living together and you left the house. You went on your own. I feel like you've seen the good side and the bad, bad side of the... Or this, the dark side of this person. <coughs> Excuse me, Paul. One. Let me take a sip of water. Yeah, I feel like you made this person feel trapped with their emotions once you left them. But this person also made you feel trapped with their. I'm getting like their toxic traits. Like, they could have been, always been very jealous. And they're even more jealous now, baby. Okay? So keep that in mind. I feel like they could have been juggling you with another person. And this could be why you left this person. And they're mad about the situation. Like, they, they're mad that you found out that you, you were getting juggled. They were mad about you seeing them in a darker side. Seeing the negative of them. They're mad because... I feel like they cried to you so you could stay with them and you didn't pay no mind to it. You just like grabbed your stuff and went. And you were ready like to just go. Yeah, I feel like this person definitely wasn't the best person for you and I can see why like there's somebody that was gaslighting you manipulating the situation juggling you but why are they trying to be jealous of you well I mean I understand why they're jealous because you know they were with you before but if this is this is a friend that you were asking about I feel like this person just feels jealous of whoever it is that is new around you like they feel like they're gonna take their place so they're really jealous about everything that's going on around you right now but let's get more clarifications here with the everyday wish tarot deck so spirit universe ancestors can we be more clear of who it is that is jealous of my pile number one and why and will they give up because if this is the ex we want them to give up right <laughs> so let's see spirit can we get some answers some clarity some more clarity on who this person is why they're doing it why they're why they're being jealous and will they ever move on that is too many can we have one at the time please spirit Thank you. Thank you. We got here the Queen of Cups. To clarify the King of Wands. Which tells me that they're definitely very loving when they are around you. And they're like not manipulating the situation. Like they're just a little bit of themselves. Or this can be your energy where you're very nurturing, loving, and caring. And this could be why they always want you around. Um, I'm getting a, 
a vision of somebody that's always cleaning and cooking and doing laundry and your person is always going out, partying, drinking, working, juggling things. Yeah. <laughs> Let me know if that resonates with you in the comment section, okay, baby? We got the King of Swords. So, yeah, this is more your energy. I feel like your person is the king of swords here, which is like somebody is very structured. Um, they want to come off like as they know everything, or they just like to be very disciplined and very structured. Um, they don't really show very emo a lot of emotions, but they are passionate towards you. That's that's definitely known. Can we have one more spirit? Thank you. We got the world card. Yeah, so this is like a, some... Uh, they're jealous of you because they didn't think this, this cycle was going to end as soon as it did. They, think, they thought they were going to be able to um, manipulate the situation when it came to you. And continue juggling you even further on. But this cycle came to an end, baby. And spirit stepped in. And they they thing. We also got here the six of pentacles. Yeah, your your person could have been very giving and loving towards others or like try to give that same mutual respect towards others. Like you were seeing your person always giving more love and affection towards other than than yourself, and that's why you were feeling trapped. Like, why is this person giving well, why is my person giving more attention to their friend than to me right now? They should be paying attention to me like we're home. Or I'm seeing somebody that's, you know, always doing laundry and, like, doing home stuff. And your person is um, just chilling in the background playing a game. And you're like, oh, he, sh he should be helping me. Or, like, he should be spending time with me right now. So let me know if that resonates with you, okay, guys? That is all that I have for my pile number ones. If it did resonate with you, let me know in the comment section. I would love to hear about it. And um, if you would like to support me, please subscribe. I would love to hear all of you guys' messages. Leave me a comment if you like as well. And hit the like button as well as the bell button so you get notified every time I post a new video, baby. Okay, now let's move on to pile number two. So, if you guys picked, now I don't even know. Oh, yeah, sorry. okay. If you guys picked shine, shine, I'm sorry, I can't say that right. <laughs> No, guys, don't come at me. Don't laugh at me. I am Spanglish, and I struggle with certain words, okay? If you know, you know. So it says shine here. Uh, influencers, creators, star. So this is pile number two. Spirit, can we clear out the energies? Spirit Universe, as this is Angel, thank you so much for coming here today and guiding me to do this reading. Please protect me and my viewers from any negative energies, entities, or thoughts. Please protect us and please guide me and help me give the most accurate, most clearest, and most accurate messages for all of my pile number two today. So pile number two, you pick shine, star, influencer, creator. So you can be a shining star, an influencer, or a creator, a YouTube creator. TikToker or your person can be right now. The question in, in hand here is why who is jealous of you? I'm sorry. <laughs> who is jealous of my pile number two? So I'm definitely getting an energy right away. <laughs> I keep jiggling, giggling, jiggling. Wow, okay. Jiggling, giggling. I meant to say giggling, but this could be somebody that's chased and jiggles their ass on stage, so that's why I just said that without um meaning to. It's always a connection, baby, okay? Um, let's see here. I'm also getting an energy of somebody that 
could definitely be an influencer, somebody that gets money, has money, has no reason to be jealous of you, but they are. <laughs> but let's get started. Let's get started, okay? Because I'll be getting ahead of myself. <laughs> this is the Everyday Wish Tarot deck. So we're going to shuffle here and we're going to ask Spirit. So Spirit, Universe has this as Angel. Higher Beings, Universe. Thank you so much for coming here today and guiding me to do this reading. Can we please know who is jealous of my power number two? Who is jealous of my power number two? Who is this influencer, this creator, this star? Can we please have some clear, honest messages here from my power number two? Thank you. Okay, we got the Six of Pentacles. I'm going to get a couple of cards out and then I'll get started with your reading part two, okay? Spirit, can we get more cards on who is jealous of my pal number two? Okay, we got the two of swords. Can we have one more spirit? Wow, that did a flip, but it didn't flip, so it's going back in there. <laughs> like it did a three three sixty. Um, thank you, spirit. We got here the page of wands as well. And in the back of the deck, we got the ace of wands. I'm trying to show it without the glare. <laughs> Okay, pal. Two. Like I said, somebody that is an influencer, somebody they worked hard for their money, for their paper, they work hard on their business. Is they're they're constantly working. Um, I feel like this person made some type of decision when it came to you or whatever it is they're passionate about. It could be you know even their business or their themselves because like I said this is somebody that's an influencer a creator or a star I feel like this person could be somebody that you were working with um, in the past and you guys were both flourishing together is what I'm getting and you guys had both a lot of passion for certain goals or like things that you guys wanted to accomplish whether it was together or separately you guys definitely had a lot of a lot of passion towards these things whatever it is and i feel like you made or this person made a decision that caused a separation from you you two whether it was intuitively them getting a message or receiving a message from a friend that clouded their mind or and like made them this made this person have a certain change and the and made a sudden decision um or you as well probably made this yeah and you know in the long run this person grew they had a new start with the ace of wands here when it came to their passionate goals and you know accomplishment that they wanted to fulfill <coughs> excuse me whatever it was that they were really passionate about definitely came through for them they they manifested their, this for themselves they worked hard for it and even though you guys separated they're still jealous of you baby they still looking at what you're doing. Um, this person can even be ahead of you in whatever it is that you want guys both wanted to do. Like, um, maybe you guys both wanted to be an influencer or YouTubers or I I'm also getting an idea of somebody going to auditions and like, you know, auditioning for movie parts 
or like shows and stuff like that and i feel like this person is jealous of you part two is definitely long ahead of you in the path so i don't understand why they're jealous spirit can we have some more clarifications here so this is the modern wish tarot deck we're going to be using now to clarify even further to my power number two who is jealous of my power number two spirit can we please have some clear honest answers thank you we got the ten of swords yeah i feel like you're per this person that's jealous of you um they feel backstabbed and they have a lot of things that they've been through or they feel really sad and hurt about the breakup with you guys or the, the separation and they're jealous of whatever it is that you got going for yourself right now problem number two even though it's minor compared to what's going on with them I feel like they're more mostly not just jealous like they're like missing you as well you also got here six of wands yeah they even though they went through a lot of, of affection I mean I'm sorry excuse me let me take a sip of water they could have had a lot of communication problems as well power number two yeah, even though they, they, the separation caused a huge effect on your person here, the person that's jealous of you, actually, whoever this might be to you, because it could be a friend, a lover, a lover, or a family member. Um, yeah, even though they went through a lot of hurtful moments and, like, reminiscing and missing you and, like, or missing the, the relationship, maybe missing the area you guys used to come together in as well like they're just really looking back at everything that you guys went through together and like even though it caused some sadness some burden some stress they pushed past it and they knew there was new things to come and they definitely succeeded they had full success here with the six of one you also got here the king of cups yeah, this person had a lot of love for you. They really cared. But they decided to move on and, like, put their emotions to the side. But now they're just watching you. They're, like, constantly, like, looking you up. Even though they have full success, they still miss being with you. So they're jealous of the people around you. They're jealous of whoever it is that you got that's working with you now. Whoever you partnered up with. Whoever you're collaborating with. Whoever you're chilling with. Whoever you're wrong it doesn't really matter they're just zealous of everything that you're doing even though they're higher up and it's because i feel like you guys either had on some type of friendship or a romantic relationship with this person and whatever decision this person took or you took that caused the separation definitely took a toll on your person um or this person that's jealous of you right now we also got here in the back of the deck the eight of swords yeah okay so the person that's jealous of you might be feeling trapped due to their emotions due to how they're feeling about you they're feeling jealous because you have a you have taken a toll on this person like you're somebody that caused a great effect on this person's life and even this they succeeded they're still jealous of the relationships that you have the people that you have around you the co collaborations that you're making maybe they're they are famous and they're shining right now but they don't have a lot of people to collaborate with or friends to celebrate with or family members to come their way to celebrate with them at the moment Yeah, I feel like this person is sad because they're alone most of the time, even though they have a lot of success right now. Pile number two.
yeah, this person definitely had a strong um, affection towards you. And the fact that you guys separated caused that effect to turn into jealousy of anything that you do, okay? And the people that are around you or, you know, wh whoever you're giving your energy to. Alright, pile number two. That is all that I have for you. I hope this resonated with you. And if it did, please let me know in the comment section. I would love to know that I'm connecting with you, baby, okay? Let me know. And don't hesitate to hit the like button. And if you like to support me here and my channel, all you have to do is hit the subscribe button. That will let me know that you're loving and enjoying the time here with me. Now let's go ahead and move on to pile number three. So if you picked gossip, conversation report statements involving details are com confirmed that are not confirmed true. So gossip, pile number three, let's clear out the energies. Spirit, universe, ancestors, angels, thank you so much for coming here today and guiding me to do this reading for all of my viewers. Please protect me and my viewers from any negative energies, entities, or thoughts. Protect us and our family spirit and guide us. Help us and bring in the most accurate and most clearest messages here for all of my viewers. My pile number three today. Okay, pile three, you pick gossip. So, um, whoever is jealous of you is definitely making statements without your authorization. They're reporting things. They're, they're trying to, um, you know, rub, rub a lot of people off with your gossip. Like, they have a lot to say about you. Whoever is jealous of you. Power number three. I feel like this person is somebody that you could have met, um, a while back and... Maybe you don't even had a long relationship with them or like a true friendship. It's just somebody that you used to conversate with at times and now they're gossiping about you and they're jealous of you. But let's see, let's see. Let me go ahead and get started. Like I said, sometimes I'm getting ahead of myself, so let's get into the cause. <laughs> Spirit, universe, ancestors, angels. Please come here today and help me give the most clearest and most accurate messages for my pal number three. Who is jealous of my pal number three spirit? Can we please know who is jealous? We got the three of wands here. I'm going to get a couple more and then I'll get started with your reading pal three, okay? That's too many. <laughs> Spirit, can we have a couple more? A oh, one at a time, please. One card at a time for my pile number threes. Who is jealous of them? I'm getting that this is somebody that you you planted things out with. Yeah, like I said prior, maybe this is somebody that you collaborated with at a certain time in your life and you're no longer you're no longer in contact with. We got here the page of wands as well. Can we have one more spirit for my pound number threes? Who is jealous of my pound number three spirit? Please and thank you. That is too many. Okay, we're going to take them because spirit says so. <laughs> we got here the two of pentacles. And the Ten of Pentacles. I don't take no reversal with guys, okay? I feel like there's enough cards in the deck for any negative energies to come through if need to be. Or any type of reversal energy that is probably within the deck. We also got here the Two of Swords in the back of the deck. And let's get started with your breeding pile number three. So who is jealous of my pound number three? 
here is somebody that maybe you collaborated with at some time in the past. Um, I feel like this person uh, could have been very passionate about whatever it is that you guys were trying to collaborate with. And I feel like you, this person say high and dry. Like, I, I feel like this person feels like you left them high and dry. <laughs> um, let me know how that resonates, okay? Um, you could have been juggling two jobs or two people. Or this person could have been juggling two jobs and two people. But they were really passionate about this this collaboration that you guys had going on this can also be a lover that you had long plans with and that you guys were planning things out for you guys's life and like you know working on getting even a business i'm hearing together and i feel like you and your person was definitely um passionate about this but you guys were both immature and not 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 immature in a sense of personally like i'm sure about how to go about this business or like the situation the relationship and with the two of pentacles here i feel like either you or your person were juggling a, a, another person or a job and this you guys are definitely very abundant as well as your person right but you're this person that's jealous of you whether they're your friend or a lover, remember to take what resonates with you and leave what doesn't fit your situation as this is of general reading. So I feel like this person, even though they had a lot with you, they had wish fulfillment, they had abundance, they have health, um, they still juggle the situation or you and this caused an effect in the relationship here. Like somebody made a decision without really thinking about it there was a lot of mystery going on and in this this person and you either separated or like made a decision to just move on from each other's life without having to collaborate any longer and this person is jealous of you is now gossiping about you like they're talking to a lot of people about whatever decision you decided to make with them or whatever the decision they they decided to make with you like they're kind of like saying oh i can't believe she did leave me behind or i can't believe i can't believe she think i'm away for her <laughs> yeah i'm getting those so you take what resonates and leave what doesn't so i feel like this person is very sarcastic um works with their ego a lot it's in their ego so just be careful with this jealous entity, this jealous energy that, you know, is obviously um, making statements and saying things that are not true. And I feel like they're reporting this to even jobs. So just be cautious. Spirit is telling me to tell you protection. To protect yourself, whether you do a protection spell or a protection spiritual um, ritual i'm sorry you know meditate ask ask for protection from your ancestors your spirit guide or god whatever you're in tune with because i feel like they're messing with your money now you don't need that right pal three <laughs> i'm also getting you guys been kind of affected by this this person gossiping about you already and some of you guys i'm not getting everyone because everyone's in a different time frame but some of, for some of you guys, this is something that's going to happen in the future. Something that's already happened for some of others. Let's go ahead and clarify here with the Everyday Wish Tarot deck. Let's get more info on this jealous person. So, Spirit, Universe, Angels, Higher Beings. Can we please clarify here what is going on? Who is a jealous person that is jealous of my pal? number oh my god oh i thought it was a three. Oh my pound number threes okay it says two of ones i thought it said three of ones i was gonna say the three of ones again 
So the two of ones clarifying the three of ones here is telling me that this person feels like they got their world in their hand. Like this got they got everything under control. Or like they got the situation under control. Sir, can we have more clarification? Thank you. We got the four of pentacles. Who is jealous of my pound of a way? I feel like this person has been saving money. Um, this person can be somebody that's very dark skin. And they definitely have long hair. I mean not that long, but their the hair is a little long. We got the Queen of Wands. Yeah, this is somebody that works with spiritual things as well. I um when I get the Queen of Wands, I get this is like my wishy witchy. witchy pile you know somebody some people are very intuitive some people are you know gifted talented you know and they're in tune with their gifts and abilities and some people are not and you this person whoever is gossiping about you whoever is jealous of you either they know somebody that deals with spiritual work or they deal with spiritual work themselves because look at how she got the one here she's like I'm getting this. I'm getting what I want. And I'm going to do whatever it takes to get it done. Whether they, this person is a male or a female. We don't read gender and tarot. So keep that in mind. We also got here justice. So yeah, I feel like this person feels like this is their justice. For whatever it is that you guys went through in the past. And that's why they're jealous, pile three. They're jealous of whatever decision you made. Or whatever... It was that you decided not to collaborate with this person in. We also got here the Five of Swords. Yeah, this definitely is the same energy as this right here. Which tells me that pile number three, your person has been doing a lot of gossiping. A lot of talking. A lot of like... Letting people know about you, trying to backstab you, um, manifesting, using spiritual tools, or going to people to use spiritual tools so they can, um, I'm, I'm getting this person, it could be so jealous, they're sending negative things towards you, or like spell work. Yeah, that's the energy that I'm getting. And they feel like this is their justice for whatever it is that you guys went through, pile number three. So Spirit wants me to know. Wants you to know, I'm sorry. <laughs> Excuse me. <coughs> I'm still a little sick, pile two. I'm sorry. <sighs> Water is good for you. So stay hydrated, pile three. But yeah, like I was saying, Spirit wants you to know that you need to protect yourself right now. To make sure that you are aware of this situation. We're trying to, they're trying to bring these messages to you. So if you come across this, make sure you take, um, you know, a little extra step of protecting yourself even more. If you have been. Or if you haven't been, make sure you do start protecting yourself because this person can be doing spell work on you. This person could be so jealous of you and how well, well you took took things when it came to this. That they're gossiping about you, they're doing spell work, they're sending you negative energies, they're sending you the evil eye. They're, they're going to people or they're doing... Um, you know, spell work on on you themselves. I'm not really sure, but I'm getting it, it for some of you. They could be going for to people for some of you that they're, they're doing something themselves because we got here the Queen of Wands. So uh, this person is definitely my wish, uh, like a wish or like I don't know what a wish man is, but a wish man. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> and this person feels like they have the right to this. To make you feel like this, like to 
I don't know what you're going through right now and if this is affecting your life right now, whatever they have been doing to you, your either spell work or you know, shadow works sent towards you or like dark work dark work energies. Whatever it is that they're trying to send to you, spirit wants you to know that you're protected but to take a further step even more to protect yourself because they can only do so much and you need to be aware of this and that's why you, they brought you to this video here today so that you can see that this person is definitely taking extra steps to try to damage even further your life and your situation so spirit wants you to know that they got your back but they want you to take even more steps than what you already have been taking to protect yourself even more you are or you are a spiritual being as well is what i'm getting and they just want you to know that this person is jealous of you because they see how bright your light is like how much more you shine than them so just know that you're very gifted you're very um enlightened you have a light light within you and that means that you're gonna draw negative people towards your light because they're naturally drawn towards the light you know so pile three that is all that i have for you baby i hope this resonated with you and if it did please let me know in the comment section please don't forget to let me know i love to hear you guys' messages and um if you want to support me hit the like button as well subscribe if you like and and hit the notification bell so you get notified every time i post a new video just like this one or anything new that i might come up with <laughs> yes baby so that is all that i hope for you and i hope you guys got something out of this and you got some type of clarity and um yeah baby that is all that i have um i hope you guys continue to be your loving lightful self bless